Namaste guys. So I wanted to show you how I warm up my shoulders for handstands and my neck. So the first move I'm going to do, I'm going to place a block under my arm. I'm going to extend my arm up and long diagonal to my body and I'm going to come down. And here I'm going to place my uh, cheek onto my bicep and I'm going to breathe here, other hand around the chest high. And you're going to inhale here, lengthen the arm, exhale and sink a little deeper. Inhale and exhale. Inhale here and exhale. So you can see I'm opening up in my body, in my chest and also in my lats, which is really, really important for mobility here. Now you can take this block off if you don't want it. This is just adding a little bit of length into the elbow area. You don't have to go down so deep. You can hold up here if you feel the stretch and you're getting that nice stretch. So then I swap it over to the other side, diagonal across and really lengthen out the arm. Inhale here, pulling your ribs and exhale. Inhale, so you're using your breath to open space on the inhale and as you exhale, there's space to move into. Inhale. Exhale, inhale here, exhale. So this is also how I warm up to start to go deeper into back bends as well. Now, the next one I like to do is to open up into my neck. So I'm going to place my chin onto the block here and then I'm going to Pulse down into my neck, like I'm trying to lift off my chin off the block and I'm opening up into that area, into my cervical spine. There should be no pain. You can pull the block back slightly and push down and under as well. And you can also bring your arms out if you want to, if you feel the block is stable and you're staying here to open up. So I'm actually feeling all the muscles in my spine strengthen as I'm creating that pull up as well. Now, after that, another option I like to do again, I like to use the block to add a little bit more depth. Hand comes out. From here, I'm going to rotate. So you can see that, rotate my arm so my shoulder comes to the mat. From here, I'm going to turn to my side and stay here, or if you feel comfortable, you can rotate up higher. And this is a fantastic opener for the shoulders, front of the shoulders, working to rotate the calf, down into the biceps. And you're really gonna breathe deeply. Again, you can take this block out and you can open up on the ground level to start with. Most important thing is to wrap that shoulder down as I showed you to get that opening up into your shoulder area. This is also great to do if you're having shoulder pain, it could mean that you're also needing to increase your flexibility. So from here, rotating, so rotating down and then rotating across here. Now, a lot of people ask how I improve flexibility and how I, as a person, recommend doing it. Well, this is doing daily stretches like this. Doing this daily is going to create change to your mobility and flexibility. If you don't do it regularly, you're not going to get anything happening. So using videos like this free on YouTube is going to make a big difference. But the thing that's going to make the most difference is you showing up to do flexibility. And release. So remember, you can take that block out and do it as well. So here is a couple of things to do to open up into your shoulders and your neck to prepare yourselves for some handstand practice. There's plenty more as well, or to start to open your upper body and neck for backbend practice. So don't forget to ring that bell and subscribe. Have a great day. Namaste.